Welcome back. Hold on. Recording is kind of laggy. Uh, uh, welcome back to another video. And it's me. I guess it's a uh, it's Virgo. I guess there I am. Yeah, stick me. And I'm gonna be doing how to get good at racing. Wait, before editor. We're not racing. We're not roasting half of the player base. Well, not really roasting. We're not. We're not really telling the truth to half of the player base. Come on. There we go. Tip number one: racing line. And also, this racer is gonna help me teach. Tip number one is racing line. Make an imaginary racing line in your head. It makes it easier to race. Sorry for the typo. Um, yeah, the racing line. Editor, please. Thank you. And the stick left. Okay. Um, yeah, so red is what you're not supposed to do. Green is what you're supposed to do. So when you race, um, when you are gonna take a turn, you should go to the opposite side and then follow the green line. And what you shouldn't do is the red line, which is like to go straight at the corner because most of these cars don't really have great handling. Well, a lot of them do, but now they don't. Yeah. Welcome back, Stig. I was about to race it. Tip number two is braking and throttle. No one to brake and throttle, so turning could be better. A lot of cars have decent turning, but you need a brake for it. And there it is, the, the little graphic. If you don't brake, so red is always going to be the not example. If you don't brake, it's, you're going to crash into a wall, and that will lose velocity, much more velocity than if you're going to brake, because if you brake a little bit, oh, the turning will increase, and then you could actually take a good turn, while the people crash into the wall and could po possibly lose control. Thank you, Stig. Um, tip number three is getting used to the chassis. The more time you spend with the car, the better your skills will be, because... You already you're used to the thing. That's why I struggle so much with Vehicle Legends because Car Dealership Tycoon is my main game and they have different chassis. So it's kind of hard to do a circuit race. Tip number four is what cars to use because yeah, there are different cars for different environments. I forgot to note the rules. Um, I'm not counting drag race. I'm not counting any type of drag race for this slideshow. Um. Tip number four, what car to use, and what cars to use for the right environment. So if you're going to use an off-road environment, you should get the Cybertruck. That's my best recommendation. Um, for circuit, um, there are a lot of circuit cars, but don't use anything under 8.5 handling. And for drag, you already know drag king, Queen of Regera. But yeah, for highway, SSC to a tar or game pass car or whatever. Yeah, just like you see on this graphic, the Devo is a better track car for circuit than the than the Tesla Roadster because obviously it has better handling, it has better top speed. So in conclusion, it's better in circuit. And in my opinion it looks better. I know I put this also down, I'm not hating on it right now, but it's just generally the truth. Alright, tip number five is handling is better than top speed. In pretty much any situation, you need a great handling car. Now, we're excluding drag from this, I already told you guys. And you need a great handling car because in circuit race or city circuit, even highway, you need a good handling car to take the first turn correctly. And sometimes top speed is in it because before the chassis update, the Koenigsegg Absolute was a beast, but it couldn't turn. So I always used the Bugatti Santo Diechi on them and beat them because that car couldn't turn at 300 miles per hour. So they had to brake a lot and they'd use a lot of speed and I'd be still going at 256 while taking that turn. So yeah, handling is way better than top speed. Um, last tip, tip number six. It's one to leave you thinking, handling or excel. Because in pretty much any situation you need a great handling car. But acceleration is another good trait. So, um, yeah, acceleration is a good trait. For example, we're going to use the Koenigsegg Regera. 
in this example because the Koenigsegg Regera is a good handling and good accelerating car. I think it's going to be the new king of the circuit, but it's um, it's a great car, but all you need to do is learn how to use it. So just leave with this thought, I might open the comments, but um, yeah, think about it. Um, bye Stig. Okay. So, and pretty much, so which is better, the Devo or the, or the Tesla Roadster? Alright, um, bye. Uh, yeah, also, merch soon, I'm gonna be releasing my t-shirt. Um, yeah, and also my suit, maybe. I don't know. Um, what are you doing, editor? Okay. Um, yeah, that's it for now. Drop a like because this took me like forever to make it took me an hour and I would it would make my day and the editors and yeah it's pretty much it um yeah drop a like drop a sub and see you guys another time.